Two years ago, the Richmond Ambulance Authority reassessed its overall fleet strategy and moved from a problematic diesel engine model to a new gasoline model. The use of solar panel technology is not a new idea. Based on the success of the RAA support vehicle and the need to re-equip RAA's fleet with a new model of ambulance chassis, fleet engineer Dan Fellows began to plan a larger solution incorporating the panels not only to maintain battery life but to provide powered life support to the vehicle's many electrical systems, thus reducing the need for the engines to run at high revolutions or high idle. This change would be eco-friendly by reducing noise, saving fuel and cutting down on emissions. Well, we're trying to find a way to both increase the efficiency of our batteries and the efficiency of our new gasoline chassis trucks. In doing research through other documents with EMS World and other agencies, we found many ambulance companies were using solar panel technology to charge their vehicles, accessory batteries, portable radios, etc. We decided it would be better for our entire system to charge the full truck. Well, in 2008, we have this resource vehicle that we use to carry equipment around to and pick up equipment from different hospitals. Because of its location, where it's parked at, we don't have any shoreline power, and we were having difficulty keeping the battery charged. So it came upon us to try a solar panel solution to keep the battery maintained without having a shoreline system. In installing the solar panel, we were able to reduce the effect of the wear and tear on the battery. It actually does still charge at night below the street light. So far, as we've added vehicles, we're up to a total of six in the fleet solar paneled. We found that the batteries aren't cycled as deeply or as hard as they would be without the solar panel technology on board. It maintains a charge throughout the system. So far, we haven't had to replace any batteries on the trucks, and they don't idle up. Well, so far on the trucks, the crews are extremely pleased. Not only do the batteries stay up, the solar panels work very well, the trucks don't idle up, which is availed to them the ability to be able to hear their patients better. The trucks are quiet, uh, it's a much better work environment for the crews, and it reduces our overall costs, both in fuel and in parts. Data assessment of fuel consumption adds to the success story. Removing the need for high idle means the engine doesn't work as hard and less fuel is used. RAA's analysis of gasoline versus diesel ambulances reveal the true efficiency. The new ambulances deliver an average of 7.1 miles per gallon, which we calculated on constant idling of vehicles and miles driven, at a current operating cost, currently, of 47 cents per mile run, whereas diesel costs 66 cents per mile to operate. While RAA is only a quarter of the way through the vehicle refit and remount program, every upgraded vehicle arriving at RAA effectively removes about $7,000 from the fuel bill per year. Thank you.